Uh, as a freshman, I'm not in charge of a whole lot, but they put us on different crews for different shows throughout the year so that everything runs smoothly backstage and the production on stage looks great. Uh, for American Idiot, I was the projection system head technician. Uh, we've got 20 TVs on the stage, 10 stage left, 10 stage right, and four projectors hanging in the house that all project images throughout the show. For American Idiot Load In, I was on the uh, special ops team, which means we basically go around and we do whatever needs doing that the ground team isn't doing and the fly team isn't doing. Uh, load In is when we take all of the scenery that we have built throughout uh, the course of the build period, which is usually like two or three months in the span of the show world. Uh, we usually build multiple sets at once here at CCM because we just have that quick of a like, turnaround time. Dead hanging a drop in the background, and and you tie those ropes off to the top of the grid, and so that's where the scenery hangs for the duration of the performances. Uh, this being a two-week run, we had to make sure those knots were really well tied. There are four lighting bridges, and that's because they wanted this show to look more like a rock show than like the average musical setup. Uh, I really think the biggest danger is carelessness. Um, there are plenty of things that can hurt you on an everyday basis. All of it is preventable from hurting you if you just have common sense. Hard hats in the space when there's people up in the air because if a shackle drops from the grid 60 feet it could probably kill you. So we take, we take all of the measures necessary to make sure that all of the students are safe. I think everyone needs to take like a moment to like go backstage in a production. Like I feel like that should be a more open experience than it is. I really think the thing about technical direction and stage crew and lighting and, and really everyone in a, in a technical field is that we're kind of the unsung heroes. Uh, we, know our, we know we did our job properly when we don't have anything said about us. Um, when you read a review and you didn't get a sound note, that means that you did your job well. Talk to pretty much any technical production student, not just technical direction student, and they will say it's a struggle to be here because not only are we full-time students, we're full-time technicians. We get out of class at 3 and at 6 o'clock till midnight we're working on a show every night. We're such a high caliber school that we're expected and we know that we're expected to just push that much further to be able to do everything that we do. The biggest thing for me here at CCM is that every single day I still learn something new. There hasn't been a day that I've come in since my freshman year that I didn't learn something new. And I think that's what's really important here is that we're always hands-on, uh, always learning our trade by doing our trade.